launch complex three, you know, looks a little different than most other over the launch pads of a vehicle this class. Uh, and we, we did that intentionally to uh, reduce the amount of bespoke infrastructure that needs to be created to support this rocket. Uh, you'll see the pad is quite clean with its propellant farms supporting the main launch pad in itself. Um, and that's really largely there to minimize the amount of infrastructure needed for rapid reuse. Launch Complex 3 is a world-class medium lift launch facility. It's constructed on pile-supported foundations. There's over 650 concrete reinforced piles that are between 70 and 80 feet in length. We have over 5,000 cubic yards of concrete on site for the foundations. And in addition to that, we have approximately 700 tons of steel in the launch mount itself. We have a water tower that has a 200,000 gallon capacity and even more capacity in our cryogenic propellant storage on site. If you go out radially from the launch mount, you'll see a series of buildings that we call the launch equipment bolts. Those house all the electrical and controls equipment needed for both the ground systems and the launch vehicle itself. Towards the perimeter of the site, you'll notice large tanks. Those are the propellant farms that store and ultimately load neutron with the fuel and oxidizer ahead of test and launch campaigns. There's quite a few block upgrades that are planned for Launch Complex 3. Most notably, you'll see block upgrades to the lifting and integration infrastructure out on the launch site itself. In addition to that, you'll see a doubling of propellant storage and a number of other assets put in place to support rapid turnaround times for both test opportunities as well as missions. With Launch Complex 3 being the fourth launch pad we've built as a company, uh, we've got a lot of experience in bringing infrastructure to life very, very quickly. Uh, we're also familiar with the Wallops Island and the NASA and the Virginia Space Team, so that's enabled us to really hit the ground running and getting this pad built in record time. Neutron is revolutionary in its design, revolutionary in its construction, and its operating model. This will bring a new capability and expanding the lift capability at the Mid-Atlantic Regional Spaceport. We have a marvelous relationship with, uh, with Rocket Lab, and uh, we're excited about beginning to launch the new Neutron rocket. Exciting times ahead, as space continues to grow. Rocket Lab with Neutron at Wallops represents an expansion of the launch capacity that's needed in the United States. You can't launch everything from the Cape, and the United States needs both Wallops and the Cape to be able to enable us to go to the moon and on to Mars. The Rocket Lab team at LC3 is one of the best teams that I've ever worked with. Um, it's a pretty driven group of individuals and I'm super excited to see construction come to a completion and move into the test campaigns with the flight hardware.